Welcome back everyone, I'm the Depressed Eeyore, this is Labyrinth for Frank, Covenant Dusk. Let's continue, but first I'm going to save. Alright, so dispatch. Uh, well, I said it was going to go to Campanula, but there's actually some things we need to do. Also, I don't remember what mode exit does what. So I think 2 is what I'm looking for. This is it. Alright. So this boss. Um, there's a formation. I don't think we have it yet. Um, that has like a ridiculous... It has, has a uh, donum power that has a ridiculous charge time. Like 12 rounds. Something ridiculous. And if you can keep that person casting for those 12 rounds. Um, that spell will instantly kill this optional boss. Otherwise, you have to fight this boss from start to finish, and I believe it has the highest HP in the game. Uh, some say that Furfur has the highest, but that might be more because she starts out immune to everything, and her resistances just only gradually drop. But this thing, um, I've done gore hits on this thing, and I recall seeing things like upwards of 70,000 damage when I do gore hits. Now remember, gore hits reduce maximum HP, so, it were, so no matter what my damage would have been, it would have at least reduced its uh, HP by a percentage. So this thing is pretty beefy, and I fought it with a lot bigger uh, bigger uh, brigade than this one. But this brigade is also particularly strong. So we'll see how this goes, um, and uh, hope for the best, I guess. Um, if we beat it, we'll probably end up getting Alice leveled up, which will be a thing I'll have to deal with. A foul, eerie air wafts from the room. So, this is Zal Zlavik. Um, it's currently, uh, its seal was renewed because the, um, the keeper was sacrificed himself to renew the, to renew the seal. Uh, essentially, this is a piece of, like, an evil god or something like that. Anyway, let's get started. That's only self, isn't it? Raises off, and it costs 10. Rearguard Hasten? Do I really want Rearguard Hasten? No. Angel's Attack. And then... Rear Attack. Everything else I'm fine. Okay. I got you. How's this? So we got that going for us. You attack. You've buffed yourself. Yeah, all your stuff's increased. Uh, did I increase everything? That's ins that's crazy. Cool. That's it's definitely worth the two hundred something I just spent on it. All right. Attack. Attack. Area heal, that's fine. Um, I can increase the void of the back row. I think I'm going to go ahead and do that. And then quick heal on everybody. Actually, you can attack for now. Here we go. An open okay, he's poisoned, that's good. Let's go! Ha! Go, go! Yeah. How's this? Looking around, 26,000 uh, damage from poison. So that's a percentage. I think it does about 10% or 5%. So that's where we're looking at as far as damage is concerned. So one thing I could do is I can buff up my offensive power. I'll do, I'll do it with Alice for now. You keep attacking, you keep attacking. At this point, everyone's buffed. I'm gonna go ahead and just do quick heals. We'll do it. You okay? Now go too. 
It's resistant to physical. Ouch. There you go. 6600 damage. I think the poison wore off already. I'm even stronger. Keep quick healing. That's fine. Here we go. There. After you. You came. Yeah, that crossbow's doing 5,000. Now go to. Here I come. Miss me. Okay, a curse spear, that spear does a, or a curse blood spear does a drain. It looks like that's fine. They're still buffed. Front row needs to be buffed again, so I'll do that now. Roger, put an opening. We'll do it. You okay? Got abyss, but doesn't really do anything. Yeah. All we want is confuse, stun, startle, and um, poison. All right, running out of uh, donut power. It looks like. I'm even stronger. Actually, who here has the highest? can't tell. Oh, actually I can tell. It's Lily Black. Okay, so Lily Black I need a buff. He's our strongest. Alright. Go ahead and work on Vanguard Heal. Uh, you go ahead and do Rear Guard uh, Avoid. You're out of power, that's fine. I don't play there. After you. There you go, nine hits. Okay, he's charged twice, so whatever's coming is gonna hit hard. So I could try to fortify and hope we endure it. But let's see what happens. Because I'm dumb. I could fight a whole army! Do area heal. I know. Here we go. An opening. After you. Ah, how's this? Uh, all right. <laughs> all right. Only hit two people. It looks like. Yeah. And his second action was confusion. So that's perfect. All right. I think your buffs worn off. They did. Here. Go ahead and buff yourself. Uh, Vanguard heal. You attack, you attack. <laughs> Calm down, does this help? Yeah. So it looks like offensive capability just means buff everything. That's insane. I mean, granted, it's the White Rose pack, and White Rose is like one of the best formations. I, I, I could fight a whole army! We'll do it together. After you. salvo. Oh my gosh. Oh my. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so each of those hits did at least. Oh, geez. All right. So that was. She she did crossbow salvo. Her attacks did anywhere from 10,000 to 20,000, and then the gore hit did 70,000, then Shanghai did another 70, like 50 to 70,000 damage. So this thing's almost dead, but we still got a ways to go. Unless we get another one of those hits in. And it is charging up. Uh, we did get it with poison, so that's good. Which also did another, you know, 20,000. Um, area heal will be fine. And just go all in. Oh, crossbow salvo again. Nice. It's our third one. We'll do it together. After you. Let's go. Ha! Ha! How's this? Yeah. Oh, great. Yeah. So it, it powered up and poison stopped it from activating its spell. So that went uh that went pretty clean. But I could not have asked for a better uh, result for that fight. Pretty much if you can keep it from doing things, it's generally pretty standard, uh, but it does hit hard when it can. Um, it's, a it's able to hurt harm Alice, which that's a an achievement in itself. Uh, I'm just going to gain the experience.
Uh, Alice is definitely gonna hit 99. Um, oh, when we get out of here. Oh, this is good. All right, a black piece of paper floats out of the Lavix corpse. It appears to be a missing page from the Tractatus de Monstrum. We obtained the black page of Modius. Obtain the Holy Lance Shard. You leave the area. All right, Holy Lance Shard. Uh, it's a one-handed lance. Um, has 189 donut power, 94 strength, reasonably high attack. Um, has decent uh, uh, chance to do a poison at abyss. And then we have the Moonlight Pact, uh, which we can take a look at real quick. Uh, Coven list. So this has area treatment, area heal 2, heal 3, delayed healing, quick heal, and heal omega. And then it has even lucky number only. So only people with an even lucky number could be in this slot. Um, and then there's all dormant costs are doubled, all dormant costs are doubled, all dormant costs are doubled. And it's 180 experience, uh, uh, 220% experience, and 240% experience. So this is kind of your grinding forma uh, formation or coven. Uh, but it does require even lucky numbers, which I don't even know what everyone's lucky numbers are. Can view their status and pull it up. Uh, it? Oh, it's up there. So yeah, we have we have uh, 26, 1, 47, 93, 64, 66, 22, 78, 76, 26. Okay, yeah. So we have a few. And the, pe the person that takes that slot will, of course, have a reduced experience, which is not a big deal. And there you go. So yeah, we're we're in good shape. Um, I could pour it out of here, but I think I'm just gonna. Yeah, you know what? I will go ahead and pour it out. I've already cashed out, so we're just gonna get less. Um, Less mana, that's fine. <laughs> I've been feeling more still beauty. I feel still about oh. <gasps> still level up. Okay. Uh let me be right back. I'm gonna go ahead and do a soul transfer with um Alice there. So be right by. Okay. So as far as my list was concerned, she was supposed to become a mad raptor next, but since I already had three of them at the moment, um I went ahead and made her, I skipped ahead to Reaper, because we haven't shown off the Reaper yet. So she is definitely going to look a lot different now. Um, I had been um, off screen, I had been fusing all of the sites I've been collecting uh, together. Um, I had about seven combined already. Um, so actually, I think I had eight combined. Um, and then I had this Putrid Comet site that was essentially the second strongest weapon and wasn't combined yet. So I combined this with all the ones that I had already combined into the little stars, and it, it's become this. It's gained an additional 801 attack, and essentially that's all the fancy stuff. Um, as you can see, the equip slot says limbs, so it took away. It's going to use both arms and your feet, so it's actually pretty easy to equip them. Um, other than that, uh, they can attack entire groups, so that's their main thing. So we'll go ahead and confirm it, and then as you can see, here she is. Uh, even at level 1, she has almost as much attack power as, uh, she actually has probably more attack power than a lot of the characters here. Um, she's right now Sun and Double Sharp. Uh, she's supposed to become eventually Double Sun, but I don't have access to that yet. Um, and right now she's, her nature's perverted, which is not really useful for the current faucet she's going with. Um, that's just to, I usually just set them to whatever I intend on keeping them as. Um, and she, her goal is to eventually become a Bell user. So, in the end, she's going to need Perverted for the extra charm. Uh, so, yeah. I mean, her charm's super low anyway, so it doesn't matter. Because right now, she is still using the Sturdy Booger Hat and the Rustic Rune Mail. Um, so, her defense is still high, just not as ridiculous as it once was. In fact, I might as well swap this in. There you go. There's your fancy shield. Anyone else need a fancy shield? I don't think anyone does. Yeah. 
No, I don't. Yeah, that's everybody. Actually, I was looking at the wrong thing. What shield did you have before? You had this one. 326. Yeah, I already have better. Okay. So yeah. Uh, so here's hoping I can get her leveled up real quick. Otherwise, it's going to be very painful for her. But she does have the additional 20% attack power, so she'll be in a, in a good place eventually. She just needs to survive long enough. So I'll go ahead and uh, save the game. And we'll uh, go ahead and dive in. I don't think there's anything else I need to mess with. I've already organized everything here. Yeah. So we do have the Nebula pack if we really want to mess with like all that nonsense, but I'm not going to. It's not yet. Alright, let's go uh, dispatch. Uh, we do not need this mod ex exit anymore, so I'm going to go ahead and remove it. Uh, unfortunately, we're going to have to take the long way to get to where we need to be, because I don't have a mud exit set up there. But that's okay. So give us some time to get a little bit of experience for Alice, because she's going to need it. Also, her level ups are going to be even slower now, because this is her second transformation. Possibly yes. Is this our second? Should be. Uh, yeah, this is her second. Yeah, everyone's done. She just transformed early. That's why hers was a little bit further behind. Okay, good to know. So even with a level 1 character, I am still way stronger than... Uh, everything down here. I can't see the enemies oh, unfortunately, but that's fine. Uh, An opening. We'll do it together. Ah! We win. Go ahead and stockpile. That thing had a lot more experience than a uh, lot more HP than I expected. That's okay. I'll just leave her dead for now. It's not a big deal. So there's two abilities that Reapers uh, I, that I want. Um, I actually didn't show those off. I apologize. Status. So. Alright, so her built-in stuff is she has Scythe Dancer, which we've shown off before. It's 12% chance to attack the enemy group four times. So it's essentially a weaker form of um, Crossbow Salvo, but it happens more often. And then there's Wick Wicker Man, where if she loses any puppet parts, her attack increases. Though I don't know by, by, by how much. And if she loses an arm or her legs, uh, she can't use her Scythes. Um, and then what I picked up from her just as initial um, is... Which one was it? Slippery. Uh, which gives plus 20% of void, which is pretty impressive. That's a lot of a void. Um, the other skill that I want from this uh, faucet is uh, plus 50 crit, um, which is like heroic body or something like that. Uh, so that is definitely the target we're picking up. Uh, as for what I carried over, uh, I think I only needed uh, dismember. Yeah, I think I only needed dismember for this build. But the rest is just there to help out. Also, what? And she's Scythe S, which means she, she doesn't actually have increased crit chance right now. That's okay. Anyway, keep on heading down. I'm trying to remember. Okay, we just need to get all the way over there. That's fine. It's not really any danger, like I mentioned before. What we're gonna do is we're just gonna bash that open go around. And we don't need to worry about finding our way through the maze since we've already, one, we've already done it, and two, we only need to punch one hole in the wall to get to uh, where we actually need to go. Got another storehouse meat key, but we don't need it. 
everything here is pretty much terrified of us. Uh, what I might do, since I'm already here, Oh, there's some places we haven't even revealed. Yeah, there's some spots I missed. Huh. Good for me. It's not a big deal. There you go. I think that's... Wait, there's something here. Let the battle begin! There! After you! They'll go too! She lost report and gained rapport. Mouse lamp. Not needed at all. Is this the same thing for the other side too? I mean the only reason I even noticed this was because of the um it's because of the enemy that was in there. Anyway, what I was gonna be doing is actually I'm gonna go fight the FOEs on this floor just to get the experience. Let the bat so stand <laughs> after you. On to the next one. Wound too deep, I'm a goner. Sorry to hear that. <laughs> yep, sure enough. I just need to make sure I have enough reinforcements to get to where I need to go. Um, I mean, even if I don't have enough, I I just need to make sure I put up a mud exit before I do anything else. Uh, those chests, I'm pretty sure I can't open yet. I think. I'm fairly certain. Yeah, I need the Fairy King's party, in, which is, well, spoiler, is what we're going to get, the next key we're going to get. this before so that was when we we're all go. much much weaker go, go. Go right. uh. this is a bear. another successful hunt enemies approaching Another freaking breath attack coming. So there, here we go. After you, you okay? Yeah. Here. Yeah. What? 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 Miss me? Okay. Rod, Slam huh? rods. An opening. But all those evades gave me a bunch of uh, attack power. Fusion. Oh, and there goes your arm. And there goes his stomach. Good stuff. Yeah, it's only like 5,000 experience. Is that a lot, actually? But that's alright. Five, only just five thousand, and all the all the items, it, all the weapons it dropped are literally the first tier. Like it's pretty much telling you you're not supposed to fight them, but still, it's better than nothing. I'll take it. All right, 
good news is I am getting rid of uh, mana here, which is good. Uh, yeah, I'll just take the poison, that's fine. Also, I never went in here, which is fine. Then we'll go here. Grab what's here. Which will put us here. Everything's afraid of us here, so we're fine. Alright, I'm currently stenched, but that's fine. So yeah, if you remember this place, this is where we had the sidetrack you fight the whale, but over here, all we have to do is go here to go where we need to go. And that puts us here. And I believe we're good to go here. I am a little curious about this wall. Okay, that's all I need to know. Nothing here should be a danger. But of course. We just need to grab what we need. Uh, Campanula Pact. I don't remember what that is. I know we have it though. Yeah, Bell Master. Okay. I'm not gonna worry about that chest. Uh, actually, I need to go that way. Alright. We won. Okay, that's the chest up there. We will need to go back through here a few times. Enemies approaching. Um, uh, we'll do it together. There. It's nothing perfect. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, there is we one won. more um, coven that we need to get access to. Uh, that'll make the quote-unquote final boss a little bit easier. And even then, that boss can really rip you a new one. I wish this stench would wear off. It's been up forever. He attacks. Wow. We won. I'll put you in place. And we're ambushed. We'll do it together. Oh, crit two damage. Nice. Yeah, since she has Alice's shield, she's pretty, uh... Nettery is pretty, uh, immune at this point. Obviously the big issue with the, the Reapers, uh, class is they're front row, and they're not durable <laughs> at all. Not even slightly. Alright. Yeah, this map is actually really simple, so I'm just gonna do this. Time to fight. The most be Here we go. An opening. It's nothing. After death. Let's go. Well fought, everyone. Time to fight. So stand here. Hey An opening. After you. Let's go. Go, go. It's a, it is a little crazy that these things didn't actually take a hit from us. We fought these things like, well, like, you know, 60 levels ago. Actually more than that if you count this, the levels from soul transfers. And they're worth far less experience. Alright, here we are. You detect the fragrance of magical roses. Who goes there? A giant, beautiful, naked man looks down at you. He has a worried look on his face. I am the Fairy King. You are... No, you don't need to say anything. 
Oh, I see. Birdie has sent to you in her stead. So you've come for the key, I take it. True, the key is in my possession. She told me to give it to the ones who possess the Tractatus de Monstrum. I was hoping she would come see me personally. Hmm. Am I too old now? Has it really been that uh, that long since I fought that man from Tannis? I saved Furia from certain death in her battle with the Great Sage because I was enchanted by her beauty. She was so beautiful that no contract was necessary for her to enlist my help. But if this is how things are between us, perhaps I should stop pining for her. Hmm. This is getting somewhat complicated. Your current master is a disciple of Furia named, uh, named Dronia, and she's younger and more beautiful too. Then I suppose I'll observe you all a little while longer then. I see. Though I am the Fairy King, I am a father first and foremost. I thought it might be fun to test my might against you, but that is no way to thank you for saving my daughter's life. Here, you may take the key. Or you may have the key. You obtained the Clovis. Daughter. Now there is one person we helped out uh, in this dungeon, and that was the weird, I guess, giant dryad thing that was in the water. Um, we got rid of the, the the I guess the thorn that was in her side, essentially. That's my only guess about it as far as saving her, but I don't know what she's referring, what he's referring to exactly. It's been a long time. Please take this as a token of my gratitude. I I insist. You obtained the Fairy King's Blade. You obtained the Fairy King's Pardon. And now I shall return to my homeland. Farewell. Now that you have the key, you shall return to base right away. You leave the area. You have the final key from the Fairy King. Hurry back to Madame Dronia. What's your rush? Alright, so one-handed sword. 817 attack, 500 hit. Has some donut power. And yeah, it's a good sword. So there's one optional boss we still have not fought yet, and we can't get access to it until we do the quote-unquote final dungeon, which we haven't been to yet. What, you thought it was over? Anyway, with the Fairy King's uh, part in, we can actually open a bunch of these chests. Uh, Splendid Saint's Shoes, really high evade, avoid, and hit. Pretty much good boots all around. Roger. An opening. We'll do it together. So I'm not gonna climb out of out of this dungeon. I will teleport out because obviously um, 5,000 uh, mana is uh, we've long since exceeded it from the the first floor. On to the next one. I'd rather not deal with death. Splendid secret garden. 574 defense, has some charm, pretty much immunity to startle, uh, stench and confuse, some donut power, hit luck, all the good stuff. Uh, while I'm here, what do you have? Just seeing what I can equip and play around with. Uh, that has charm. We want to leave that alone. Yeah, I think that's fine. Okay. So let's grab all the chest. A little flower. Blah blah blah. Uh, do, 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 do. Okay. So I'll backtrack to. Um, I'll backtrack to get those chests. I don't remember if the other floors have um, have a uh, lock chest still. I'll have to look. Actually, I can look now, I guess. There's a few, but I don't. Those. I think that one's actually locked with Fairy S key. So yeah, the person that was here on this floor, I think, was maybe the reference is maybe the guy's daughter, but I'm not sure. 
Yeah, I'm pretty sure the chest that's here is Furia's key. Uh, but the ones here should be fine. So, um, Also, I think there might be a chest here that has Furia key as well, but I have to confirm it. Which is unfortunate, but that's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Time to fight! I don't put <gasps> we make a good after you! We'll do it. It's nice to let's go! <laughs> we won! Thanks to me. Let the battle be this hut! Hey! <gasps> we won! Very key. Uh, with that in mind, I guess I can do a. Can I? Can I afford a bot exit here? Yes, barely actually. Uh, let's heal up a little bit. So I just need to make sure I keep um, Alice alive for one fight. Which is unfortunately easier said than done in these narrow hallways where I can't see the enemies because I'm still stenched. I think I, I have an item that removes it, but at this point I'm going to have to run through some damage tiles anyway, so not going to matter much. Roger there. Hit! On to the next one. Enemies approaching. Uh, uh, after you. We won. Thanks to me. One, two, three, go! So put. We'll do it together. There. Okay. We won! Thanks to me. Let's uh go ahead and do a revive right now, just in case. Uh, what a Heal you to night. full even though you can't take a hit. I'm not going to hang out here while I have stench active. Whew, all right. What removes stench? Thank you. Oh, I can't even get back there anyway. Alright, well, I'm just gonna fight this then. I could if I had reinforcements, but I don't have any left. I will annihilate you! Roger. Oh, yeah. An opening. Down. After you. Two down. Let's go! Alright, we'll cash out. You and then we'll teleport out. Now. Seems about right. So 18 levels for Alice. Uh, during battle, Tracti's Karma replaces your luck stat. And those are all good too. I uh, don't need Reflex of Hardening. Is there anything else I need to... Uh, let's get rid of Body Touch, actually. Oh, how'd I get so it's not like she lives long enough. Okay, and then we'll teleport out. Uh, we'll grab the items next time, because I'm just about out of time, so... Seems about Five right. more levels. Learn Repel. 
uh, one attack here, and he's attack is reduced by 25%. Uh, we'll get rid of Squishy Body. Actually, we'll get rid of Master Masochist because that's not gonna save us. Still get beauty. I feel still. Oh, am I stronger now? Don't need. It. Okay. This is good. Uh, let's get rid of total recovery. Sure, we'll get rid of total... Yeah, we'll get... Uh, yeah, we'll get rid of total recovery. About still getting stronger! Uh... Not useful. Level up! Swordmaster, Hammermaster. That's all redundant, but that's fine. I'll get rid of it. It's not a big deal. Okay, uh, princess notes, uh, nothing new yet. Alice, Alice has double, over double her, her HP now, which is nice. Uh, next level up looks, next soul transfers look like, uh, Kokuma, Mailing, and that's about it. Uh, Kasumi's gonna stay as a care fortress, that's fine. So yeah, I'll go ahead and call this a video. When we come back, we'll go and grab those chests we missed, and then um, report in. So I'm Theodore Prestigio, this is Lab Refrain, Coven of Dusk. See you guys next time.